Welcome back to Until Then. <laughs> Welcome back to Until Then. We are here at what, what seems to be the science laboratory. Uh, going, trying to, uh, we are trying to cheer up Luis here. Ooh, cute little water bottle. Checkmate, I love the chef's reference. Little egg up there. It's nice. It's cute. So, this is yours? Oh, yeah. I leave it here sometimes since no one else comes in. Didn't know you were sus- Didn't know you were a stickers girl. Ah, they're Sophia's. She insisted. Of course she did. It looks really nice. It suits you too. Forgive my look. Yeah, I think it does too. Forgive my look, I don't want to change, so you got me in pajamas. Deal with it. I don't care, really. Maybe a little, I don't know. Hmm, what else would help Luis? What's that? I wonder when we'll actually use this. This thing's just good for pictures on the school socials. I think that's a... Bet Luis knows about it though. That's a, what's it called, a, a hood. Like a, a chemical hood? I, I I set up my camera over there before, but now it's, it's like straight on, so... Yeah, I got a l cool little camera jig, so... It's gonna be nice. It's gonna be much better. It already offers a much better viewing experience for people, so... Yeah. Hey, does this thing really work? The fume hood? That's what it is, the fume hood. Sort of. It drains the toxicities out. But it can't do that quite well. Old equipment? Possibly, even though they still clean it. Huh, for publicity, of course. Hmm, what else? What else? What is that? Events! Is that her on the bottom? Congrats, Louise. Periodic table of elements. She really is impressive. Lab safety. Oh, wait, there was more to that. Oh, well, didn't look that interesting anyways. I'ma look again. What's down here? Lab safety. What is a man's span action? Yeah, she already knows all this. Seems so. Ooh. Are those a bunch of trophies back there? You want some of those, right? What's that? Those trophies. Oh, yeah. Science quiz bees. As expected of a president, planning on bringing some home, bringing, <laughs> planning on bringing home the bacon this year. <laughs> I guess. It's yours for sure. Great job, me. Great job. Great job, Mark. Go for the most cliche thing you could ever say. The thanks. Meanwhile. Meanwhile. All I have are in-game trophies. Get that platinum on whatever cart game that you have. What is that? Interesting. We studied the ones on the left. What are those on the right though? They look like random doodlings. Hey, I'm just curious. Yes? What are those arrows and squiggles? Oh, that's mine. I'll make sure to erase that later. Uh, okay. Not the answer I was looking for. But I don't know if I should push her for it right now. Yeah, probably not. Well, that's a lot. Science. That's big brain territory. Big brain indeed. Understand science. Need big brain. Big brain. Make big revelation. Chemistry. Yep, she's got all her stuff in there. Ooh, chem closet. We get to only end it. We get to enter this lab only a few times. But if you're trusted and a respectable class president, you get access to most of the school. The world's your oyster. <laughs> you come here a lot, right? Uh, yes. I prefer this to the library. Especially if I need to be alone and clear my mind. Yeah, cause. 
pushy little bitch girls will be just in the library talking shit about everyone, like usual. It's much more peaceful here after all. Less people, yup. Library's no good, yup. Yeah, peaceful. That's good. I'm glad she feels at home around here. I'm not sure if I'm doing a good job of cheating her up though. Yeah, you're doing a pretty crap job. I don't know what you've been doing. Sky, oh, that's cute. Didn't think she didn't think she'd keep pictures. Hey, a strong sticker, a stronger? Is that a dark fiends thing? This doesn't look quite like homework. Impossible. No. Oh wait, maybe. Oh, that's our theories. What's with these arrows and squiggles? Oh, that's mine. Don't touch it. <laughs> All right then. What are these anyway? It's hard to explain. It's college level math. Wow. So not all. Wow. College math. Dang, you're really something. How do you know? All I know, I'm sorry, that's a stupid voice. How do you know all of this? Because she's smart. She big brain. Soon as they wish, soon as they wish they had the same level of smarts. That's why we look up to you. You're like the perfect student. A teacher's pet, you mean? What? S sorry. How long did you experience those visions again? Um, unclear. I told you. My perception of time seemed faulty. Okay, okay. Give me one more minute. You sure you're okay? Yeah, just... Just give me a minute. Alrighty then. I, I was... I thought I had it, but... But what? What did you have? But... But since your perception of time was compromised, which is one detail I overlooked, I think that it's very likely that... It was a prolonged hallucination. Yeah, it was pretty long for that hospital scene. That was too long. But... But why? As much as I hate to say this, there's simply no other reasonable explanation. I've gone through almost everything, and the only logical conclusion is... You're dumb. <laughs> Still, it's in the mind. Hmm. What about those online stories? If you had this bizarre experience, you'd likely flock to others who experience the same. Think of survivorship bias. True. But what was that new hypothesis you were talking about? It's... it's no use now. It's crazy anyways. I wanna hear it. It's just that the only other strange unexplained event... N never mind. It, it sounds crazy even to me. What does? Mark, forget it. It's beyond logic, and I fear that people will think we're out of our minds. Who cares? I care, and that's why I don't want to go in that direction. Are you sure? Y yes You don't sound sure. Mark, I'm sure. It doesn't make sense. But what if you're right? But what if I'm not? That's... That's okay. No, it's not that simple. Do we insist or do we accept? Because she sounded pretty unsure. And now she's getting all mad about it. But if I know women, and I don't, it's better to just accept their words. Why not? It just isn't! Guess which one I clicked. S sorry again. No, no, it's my bad. I didn't mean to. And then she gets up and leaves. Oh, sorry. It's okay. So, you're sure, right? It's all in our heads then? There's no other way around it. We can't keep refuting it, but we'll, 
could just go around in circles. I'm afraid that's all I have. Nothing else makes sense. It it's got to be the only sane answer. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much, Luis. I'm sorry, Mark. I tried. No, don't apologize. I mean it. I I didn't mean to disappoint. I I can keep looking into it if you want. Hey, there's no need. We'll just go back to square one, right? You know about this more. Yeah, you know about this more than I do. After all, Mark, I'm I'm not. It's not like no, really. I should be the one saying sorry, you know, for pushing you. I just wanted to believe. But if, if it's a product of a troubled mind, then it is what it is. I really am sorry, Mark. Thank you. Thank you, Lucas. Thank you. Thank you for telling me that I am messed up in the head, and you're messed up in the head, and everybody's messed up in the head. Because we're all just a little messed up. Alright? For researching all this. Thank you. For making time. Thank you. I know you must be busy, but thank you. Of, of course. You too. You came from the piano club, right? Yeah. I've been working real hard. Gotta say, my mentor's really tough and... Uh-oh. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Damn. How could I forget? I forgot to tell you one thing. Go ahead. You know Nicole, right? My mentor? Yes. When I saw her for the first time, it felt like... Like you'd known her before. Exactly. Wait, how did you... No. No, it can't be. What? It, it's insane, but I might be right after all. See? All you had to do was trust yourself. Come on, Louise. Come on. About your new theory? If you feel like, like you remember her, then it must be. Uh, but it's crazy. Indeed. It's crazy, but we finish each other's sandwiches. It might be right. It might be right. So, what now? What's your theory? We used to haven't explained that yet. What is your theory? Come on. Tell me your theory. Alright. Okay, we're just... I guess we're at the mall this time. You know what, are we going in the afternoon though? It's a pays to be prepared young man. See you, meet you at the mall at 4 p.m. So it's not too hot out. Yes, ma'am, it won't be late, that's for sure. See ya. Just got here. You? Where's this B at? Where's Kathy Portillo at? Portillo. Cat, more like Kathy Patio because she's a, what was it, a floorboard? I forgot what she said. What did she say? I don't know. Right. Thriftita. Hmm. That's a really good name for a thrift shop. That's a really good name for a Filipino thrift shop. That must be it over there to the right, if I'm right. I love the use of Babayan as well. It's great to see that. Wait. He said it's to the right, so I'm going to go left. Because that's how it works. You go the exact opposite way that you're meant to go. Just so you can see if there's any freaking... Uh, if there's any Easter eggs or anything. Oh, that's her! My wallet won't let me forget. <laughs> that's the, the pregnant lady. Oh, that's cute. See? You miss stuff like that if you just went off right away. Sup, Lada. New way of dressing. Coming soon. Looks like a game store. Barber. Barbero. Angry. Oh, I get that. You could have just said it's an. Oh, there's another angry. This is the Jolly Bee reference there. Angry me. 
Oh, there's Thrifty, though. Should I get a maybe or an Angry Meal? Or no, a Mad Burger. Okay, never mind. Why did he say? Oh, maybe to the right of his direction and not my direction. That makes a lot more sense. Oh well. Trying to find all the Easter eggs, that's what I'm trying to do. I feel like there should be more Christmas music playing in the mall, especially when it's Christmas in the Philippines. There's a guitar shop, that's great. No, I don't feel like this is the right way. Oh, okay. I look. Alright then. Don't put anything over there. Come on. Come on. Just trudging my way down the mall. Hor, hor, hor. Four V. Oh, there she is. Yo, Kath. Thriftita. Ooh, ukai, ukai. No food or drink inside. Welcome. Hey. Ho ho! Look who is in late. I told you so. Good. Because it's because it should be a gold mine in there. Does that mean you've already found yourself an outfit? Nope. But it looks promising from here. Let's get to it. All right, Kathy. Let's see what kind of dresses will match your f f floorboard personality. That's an insult, right? Floorboard? I wonder if Nicole would like any of these. Kathy did say I should ask her to prom. Yeah, you should. Oh, yeah, you should. I can't go out. Oh, 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 it won't let me go out. Okay. Hmm, what's in here? 60 pesos, 80 pesos? Damn! Hell no, bro. Green is not your color. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. What are you contemplating about? It's hideous. I love it. What? I'll be the hottest 70s time traveler around. Oh, it's for like me. Never mind. Wrong era, unfortunately. Try something a little more ancient Greek. I don't suppose they sell any togas around here. That would be a sight. You never know, though maybe we should just show up in blankets and call it a day. Exactly! Exactly! Think you could pull it off? I'll have you know, I'll make the most gorgeous blanket burrito. You know what? I agree with that. You better not. Alright, what else? What other crazy ones and things that they have in here? Crazy discount! Go in the fitting room. Wow, I gotta say, this is this does not have a lot. Oh, she got something. Oh, she found a toga! She only found like a toga thing. What do you think? I mean, it's not for me, but it's not. You know what? It's nice. That's nice. Mm, very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. I haven't watched Borat ever. Even you might actually look like a goddess in that. Wow. A rare compliment. Almost. I'll go try it on. Do, 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 do. Let's see what else is there. Ooh. What's in the bargain pile? Plain white shirt? Yeah? Could be that could work. Don't go in the same booth now. Oh, I gotta get dressed once again. Uh hello? Oh, I gotta go from there. Boop, boop. That's it. That's it? No bro, the pose is like this. Joma. Jome. I'm just looking for something to wear for prom. I know, I know. I'm not... I won't be home too late, I promise. Just let me... Please, where... Yes, I know the budget. I know... Oof. Oh, she looks down. And I look pretty... <laughs> you look like Jesus. <laughs> hmm. You may be right. <laughs> 
He wasn't exactly from ancient Greece. No, he was from Rome. <laughs> Close enough. Uh, you know me. I'm honest. Hey, is everything okay? Don't need to go home yet, do you? Nope. We've still got time. But wait. Are you really going as Jesus? Oh, uh, I mean, I look pretty fly. Think I could turn water into wine? You're right. She might regret saying yes to this. What about you? Didn't like the dress? Hmm. It was gorgeous, but out of my price range. <laughs> Maybe something long-sleeved. Alright. Guess we better keep looking. Ma'am, sir. <laughs> What other things do they have here? Ooh, ooh, what's here? Ooh, that looks a little bit more Wild West if you ask me. Any luck? Any luck over here? Only for that time traveler for that from the seventies. It could be the god of time. Wait, you could be the god of time. I don't think you particularly enjoy the disco era. Well. Suit yourself. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to find a suit for myself. Great pun, Kathy. Much appreciated. This is a pretty small shop, I must say. Two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree. Ooh! Now that, that's a, that's a looker. That's a keeper. That's a keeper. Uh, how do I get? How do I? How do I get to her? I I gotta come around this way, right? Yep. There we go. That's a looker. That looks real good on her. Where'd you find that? <laughs> Very Persephone of you. I would make an awesome queen of the underworld. Ah yes, Kathy, queen of hell. Are you getting it? Hmm. This dress is really nice, but maybe a bit too short for me. Well, suit yourself too. This is a dress. Wow. A duo. You're right, that's a dress. That was really nice though. You should have got that one. Bet any girl would have taken you with, with that suit, with that dress on. Are you having a better time than me? Lots of pretty dresses around here, but... I don't know, man. I can't seem to find one that works. And you? Not ev Nothing's caught your eye. At all? I'm not sure I'm really feeling this Greek thing. Yeah, I don't think they have a god of stupid. They probably did, actually. Then you can just go as yourself. You wound me. Hey, <laughs> come on. Let's keep looking. All right then. Whatever you say, Kathy. That is your re real name, Catherine. Pa, 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 pol, 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 pa, pa, pa. What's her name? What's her last name? Po, polito, poli, po, po, polito. No, it, it can't be. It's... Wait, that's me. That's Mark. It's perfect! But it's just a suit. It isn't just any suit. Look! <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. I think I found the one, Kath. <laughs> this is the cheat of all cheats. Isn't it perfect? You know what? I suppose it is. I did tell you to go as yourself after all. He's like, wait, you're not Greek, man. Guess what? <laughs> but I wonder if Nicole would like this. Uh, what about you? Any luck yet? Uh, most of the dress aren't long-sleeved. Does it have to be? I just uh, want to be one of those goddesses. A goddess with billowing gorgeous sleeves. 
so powerful, you know? Right, 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 right. Let's keep looking then. This is exactly how it feels to shop with your girlfriend. You pick something and then you wait for her to pick something and then you spend the rest of your day in that shop or you go to other shops. I think we've exhausted all they had to offer. Ah, this is harder than I thought. Yeah, actually, I liked one of the suits. You didn't get the suit! But eh, maybe next time. Why did you not get that? You said it was perfect. And it was what, on the 60 pesos rack? Come on. Don't tell me it's what I think it is. Come on, let's look elsewhere. My dress has got to be here somewhere. Right if you say, Katharino. Or chicken rage. Or just a sundae. Hmm, no, maybe an angry meal? Or actually, a sundae? Make up your mind, lady. Why is he angry, Papa? He's a capitalist. <laughs> what the fuck? So, what's your mother's maiden name? Uh, hmm. Do you like grapes? Oh, this girl's trying to... What the frick? Who would ask that? What's your favorite element on the periodic table? Mine is uranium. Because it glows. This is going to be way out of your budget, man. Way out of your budget. Hmm. Do you want to go in? Out of your budget. I think it's a little bit over... Yeah, I knew it. Honestly, I think it's a lot a bit over our budget. Ah, this is impossible. You know what? I think I think there's other stores, you know? It's probably just as expensive though. We can go back to Thriptita. But clothes aren't gonna be magically different when we get there. You never know. Come on. I've not given up yet. Pizza. Just go for pizza. Just wrap a pizza around you. Anuba! Still not happy? I didn't say anything. <laughs> Damn, okay. So our sales should be going up, ma'am. Ah, it's just like that telenovela. Job here. Okay, uh. Maybe you can make a dress. A wonderful idea from the god of stupid. No, I was just thinking of learning how to. I don't know, scrapbook. Make collages and stuff. Oh, what for? Just to pass the time. You know, pick up something new. Have something to do. Plus, I can put all the photos Riddell took of us three. As if he'd let you cut up his photos like that. Oh. Remember when he lost it because he accidentally spilled some of his oh-so-precious coffee? How could I forget? He was so mad! <laughs> it sounds like left. I'm trying to laugh, but it sounds like I'm crying. <laughs> I thought he'd never let us touch his stuff again. That's our president hipster for you. It was pretty good coffee, though. You're right, though. I wouldn't want to mess with his photos. And I'm not really much of an artist. Maybe something else. Oh, like what? Let's walk around and see. Whatever you say, Cather. Catherino. Over there! <laughs> oh, it's Samantha! And Elise! And what's this dude's name? Sundere guy. I forgot his name. Archie? He seems like an Archie. Aha! Coming over to the dark side, are you? I knew spending all that time with a piano club would entice you. Nuh uh. Piano's cool and all, but it's not really my type of instrument, you know, that's true. Just like the one with. Uh, the one. Uh, the one. Uh, the one. Uh, the one chooses the wizard. The music. In uh, uh, I can't move, speak. The musical instrument will always choose the player. It brings out your inner self. If you're really quiet and introverted, there's good, it's either like flute or clarinet. If you're really loud and like, like the louder you are as a person, like your true self, that's the instrument you'll be. Because I, I play trumpet and trumpets are pretty loud. They can also be pretty annoying. But if you get it just right, they can be one of the most beautiful instruments to ever play. Planning on serenading someone? Don't you dare say it. Uh-oh. She's gonna be called home. 
Annoying spam calls, am I right? Yeah, also known on your device as M-O-M. -M. Right, music, of course. Maybe I can get Nicole someday to encourage her for our audition day. Say, what do you think of this guitar? Do you think it'll suit me? Yeah, actually, yeah. Definitely not a new instrument, but maybe. New sheet music? New books for her compositions? I wonder. You're thinking about Nicole and not Kathy. Hey! Hmm? Are you okay, man? You're kind of spacing out. Sorry. Ju I'm just thinking. About her? What are you, were you saying? Alright, Mr. Change the Subject. I said check out this guitar. Maybe we can jam. <gasps> jam. Like this channel right here with this video in the corner. If I decide to put it. <laughs> So I'm the keyboardist and you're on the guitar. Hmm, why not? That actually be, 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 be that actually be pretty cool. We could start a band. We'd put Riddell's obscure music taste to shame. We could form a cool trio. But first, we should have a strange yet charming band name. Hmm. Think of Wyverns. Antarctic Apes. Yeah, Antarctic Apes are out there. One trajectory. Okay, that's just that's just straight parody. Radio nose, pencil heads, <laughs> radio heads, pencil nose. Hmm. I gotta say, pencil heads is actually a pretty good, cool, pretty cool band name. Pencil heads, best friends forever. <laughs> Riddell would hate us. He'd probably say we're sellouts. He'd take a really cool photos of us though, at our gigs. At our gigs in your room, you mean? He'd still make it look cool. Man, I haven't found anything yet. At least I found something. I'm sorry. If it's even there, you didn't even buy it. You're right. I don't know much about the guitar, though. It's just not me, I guess. And we might all be a little too pretentious then. Huh? I meant for prom. <laughs> oh, right. Come on, then. Tech whiz. Why is everyone avoiding me? I just want to sell phones. Phones with a whopping 16 megapixel front cam for those perfect shots at wedding days. And plentiful 32 gigabits of internal storage for all your digitized annulment papers. For when your marriage fa- <laughs> What the fuck? Lisa- Oh, what? Yo, what? What the freak is that? Dude, that's so- <laughs> You can't just pull a an ad like that and make it sound really good. And then immediately turn it into a sob story. That's why everyone's avoiding you. It's because you're crying over there over Lisa. Aw, he dropped his Ube ice cream. That sucks. Time Dome. Oh, let's go. Let's do an arcade. Let's play arcade. Oh, no. No way this place is shutting down. Aw, that sucks. Rip in peace. Rest in peace in peace. We used to have so much fun around here. At least I'll go down in history as the king of gold rush. You wish. What a bummer though. Yeah, I can't believe it. It's really gone. That sucks. I guess people don't come here anymore. There's plenty of people though. Goodbye, Arcade. You were a lot of fun. But I guess your time has come. And that kind of rhymed. Thank you for your service. You will be missed dearly. Everyone press F. F to pay respects to this arcade. Time dome right there. Alright, let's keep going. Look a new store. Flower power. Flat Why? I call. I call. Hey, can I borrow your homework? Yeah, be sure to change it up so it doesn't look like we copied each other. If you're gonna do that, at least put like power the way you spelt flower, but then it would be called flower pour, so it wouldn't really work. Ta da! What do you think? I don't see any dresses around here. That can wait, man. Let's go in! Bro. Bro, what? Bro, what? <laughs> Ooh! I was thinking I'd check out some basic baking sets. You're into baking now? 
Never knew you were into baking. Well, not yet. But who knows? You're gonna try it one time with one baking set. You're gonna fail and never use any of what you used ever again. 100%. Can I have a cupcake? That's it. Maybe something simple. Maybe she'd like some cookies. That's a simple gift, right? Not too serious or anything. Still thinking about Nicole, eh? You're with Kathy right now, dude. Would you like to buy some cookies? Uh, I think so. For a gift. Perfect. We got some heart-shaped cookies for that special someone. N no, it's, it's not like that. Got someone in mind, sir? I'm not sure. You're in luck, sir. You can never be unsure with any of our three offerings. A grand total of three. Please, have a closer look. We have your regular good old circle cookies. For your beloved, we've got heart-shaped cookies. And for a limited only, we're selling these cute smiley cookies. But I guarantee all of them are scrumptiously good. Interesting. Take your time, sir. Which one should we pick, guys? Should we go with the mistletoe, Santa, or Rudolph? Hmm. Hmm. Because we want to woo Nicole, right? We want to make her make sure that she she knows our feelings. For I, I'm pretty sure she still she knows already. But I think to make it a little lighthearted and fun, I think we all have to go with the emoji cookies. They're, they're just a little fun, right? They don't they don't make it seem like we're trying too hard. Okay, emoji. Excuse me. Oh, emoji. I mean, yeah, smileys or whatever. So that's what kids call them nowadays, huh? Well, whatever it's called, these cookies would surely bring a smiley to that special someone. Oh gosh. Seriously? Emoji? You just make a fool out of yourself, Mark. Or maybe not. I don't know. Bro. What? You want me to take the hearts then? Are you telling me to take the hearts? Nah, I'm sticking with my choice. I'll take the emojis. Alright, ma'am. I'll take a simple... On one box of smiley cookies. Here you go, sir. Have a look first. What do you think? I like the packaging, I guess. Yeah, I'll take this one. Oh, good idea. I'm getting a little hungry. Oh, um, these are for no one. What? Uh, okay. Be like that. Don't tell me. I call dibs for taste testing your cookies, though. Uh-huh, Mr. Change the Subject. I promise I'll make you the best mediocre cookies around. Excuse me, is this all you're getting? Yep. Random leg shot there. Let me ring you guys up. Are you two going to see the fireworks? Fireworks? That's right. There's going to be a Christmas fireworks display. It's about the city plaza in about 30 minutes. You two could enjoy your cookies over there. Mark, a firework show! We have to see it, please! Please, 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 please! Uh, are you sure? You're not needed at home. You're not needed back home right yet, right? We stayed out later than we thought. Oh, you, come on, it's fine. Unless you have a date? Hey, no I don't. It's settled then. It's like the stars have a line for this moment. You're, you're right. Yes! Come on, let's go find a good view. Alright, but don't get mad at me if your mother scolds you. Let's get out of here. It's starting soon. Which way do we go? You should lead the way for once. Something wrong with that plant? I'll never use an elevator again. It's giving me bad vibes. Something about the, the plant? Okay. Oh! The game crashed. <laughs> the game crashed. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. 
Why did it crash? No. Please tell me it's saved until... Please tell me it's saved. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, man. Okay, let's see where we're at. Please tell me I'm back at where I am. Don't pull me back in the mall. <clears throat> well, pull me back in the mall, but like... Oh, thank goodness. Oh, good. Okay. Man, look at that view. This is perfect. That is a pretty good view. That, that is a pretty good view. Nothing beats a good fireworks, sir. Yeah. Just forgetting your worries for a moment and admiring the colors. Fleeting bursts of light in the dark. I used to hate fireworks. But somehow it's enough to make everything a little brighter. I used to hate fireworks. But then I got over my fear of big loud noises. Kind of. I still hate them. But with fireworks I can expect them. So it's all good. That was beautiful man. Didn't know you had it in ya. Oh shut up. Even Riddell would be impressed with that poetry. You started it. Fleeting bursts of light and all that. Oh, that used to be like us. I miss Riddell. I miss writing him. I mean Riddell too. Yeah. He's doing great for himself. You know what? I, mi I miss my man too. I miss my boy. But he's thriving. I wonder if they want to grow up so fat as fast as we did. Man, taking it all for granted, huh? They should cherish it while it lasts. All the free time in the world. Time to, time to play together. Not worrying about big things. Not worrying about what comes next. <laughs> Not worrying about failing art class. <laughs> Not worrying about falling in love. Oh, hey, hey, that hurt. That's glass, ma'am. Gonna give me a concussion. What a year, huh? It's almost over and all sorts of crazy stuff happened. Riddell getting his big break. You and Nicole. <laughs> Nothing for me. Is he gonna start looking sad? Yeah. It, it hasn't been so bad, right? Yeah, just crazy. Aw, poor boy. Is he lost or he doesn't have someone? gonna start crying. Ah! There you are! There you go. <laughs> Sorry, were you waiting long? The twins parents didn't stay with you? No, not long. She probably thought you were close by. Next time, ask her to stay with you, okay? How could she never be without a caring grown-up around? But I'm a big boy now! I know, I know. But I love you, Anne. I want you to be safe, okay? 
Okay, Mom. I love you too. So now all. From the call. Oh, Andrew Portillo. Good PM. Are you Mark? I'm sorry for the abrupt message, but I saw you on Kathy's friend there. She hasn't been replying. We're worried for something happened to her. Do you know where she is? We'd be glad to know if she's all right. Our mom's really worried. Oh wait, that's her brother. Thank you. Oh, cat. Your brother's looking for you. What? Don't reply. What? Why not? He sounds worried about you and your mom too. I mean, I just don't want to go home yet. <laughs> Maybe we just let him know you'll be back after the fireworks. Just so they don't worry, you know? I, I don't know. But right. I guess that sounds good. It's probably best. It's probably best. Besides, they might get mad if I don't tell them, right? Yeah, you're right. Just tell them we're safe, okay? Nothing to worry about. Hello, Andrew. Yeah, we're at the mall. Nope, we're at the convenience store near the mall. We'll be home. Just waiting for the fireworks show and then we're going home. So, what do you say? Nothing. I think we're good. Or she's gonna get picked up by both of them. Yeah. Sorry, what were you saying? Uh, not, nothing, haha. <laughs> Just, you know, this year's been crazy. Oh, that reminds me. Can I ask you a crazy question? Yeah, shoot, man. Lately, have you... Have you had any weird memories? Or anything like that? Hmm, weird memories? Like deja vu? Yeah, exactly like that. Well, I guess. I guess I get weird feelings sometimes. Sometimes prolonged, like something's gonna happen? But I don't know. Why do you ask anyway? Oh, it's nothing. Just. been reading about it online. And you're feeling the same too? I think so. I think so. It's probably just natural though. Hey, don't overwork yourself, man. You should take breaks, okay? Yeah, I know. I guess things have been a little hectic lately for me. I mean, I've been pretty... pretty busy. So I thought maybe I'd just been tired. It's always those exams before the Christmas break, eh? Yep. You know it. You know it. And all your kid now. It's all it's raining again. Oh dear. Project of government could be. Huh. That was sudden. But, what about the fireworks show? They must be cancelling it. No. It was supposed to be perfect. Of course I did. No umbrellas for you. No umbrellas to s for you to steal over here. Ha! I'm a changed man. 
I'm sorry we couldn't find a dress for you. No worries. There are more important things. Are your parents coming home this Christmas? No. They probably send over some Christmas money though. They always do. But they're they're doing all right. Dad sent me photos a while back. And mom's out there. You know, busy as always. Your parents work really hard, huh? I wouldn't have a a better life if it weren't for them. Yeah, that's good. And how's your family? Oh, you know, same old, same old. <laughs> I don't see them often, do I? That's all right. They like to be busy too. Besides. You know, not, they're not really people persons. Yeah. <laughs> for it is only I who can engage with this. For it is only I who can engage with society. <laughs> Listen, I, I know you both, you've been pretty busy. We both have, but you know, you've still got me. We've got each other. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry Piano's been taking up so much of my time. Don't apologize, man. Just promise you'll get really good at it, okay? That's what I want. Believe me, I'm trying. You must be even busy practicing at home every night. Practice makes perfect after all. And man, does it feel so rewarding. You know, I couldn't get the proper hand posture at first. Uh-huh, but when I got the hang of it, my playing just magically got better. It almost feels like cheating. That sounds fun. How that must have felt. It is fun. It's so satisfying. I, I had a lot of fun today, Mark. Me too, Kath. And I promise. I'll have more time after audition day. You're gonna blow everyone away. <laughs> Probably except for Carlo. That's his name. Carlo's his freaking name. I'll be cheering you on in the audience. Just don't bring pom poms. <laughs> or at least if don't if Carlo's there. <laughs> I'm really glad I get to see you like this, you know. Like what? She's getting picked up right there. Happy. There's her mom or her brother. Catherine! There you are! You were supposed to be home hours ago. Oh. Kath? It's all right. It's just my brother. Thank you for your help, Mark. Hey, hey, that's that's not. But I thought you wouldn't. It's cool. It's cool. I'll see you, okay? He's not even holding the umbrella for her. Like hell, you will. How many times do I have to tell you? Let's go now, Mark. I. Yeesh. Wait! You forgot your cookie cutter! And they're gone. Should I have ignored him then? Hmm. They would have found out anyways, right? Hey, Luis. Something came up. Hey. Have you talked to anyone recently? I was with Kat today. Did you ask about it? A little. She said she's been having some deja 
Deja vu. How can you get those apostrophes? I don't even know how to get those apostrophes. Why would I ever use those apostrophes when autocorrect can do it for me? But I'm not sure if it's like, if it's exactly the same. I knew it. It doesn't matter if it's exactly the same in this case. Either way, this brings us a step closer to working my hypo to my working hypothesis. Who's next? Nicole? Kate? Elise? Hmm. Who's next indeed? Indeed do. Is she going to like these? Oh man, I knew I should have gone with the other ones. Emoji cookies. What was I thinking? Ugh. She's gonna laugh in my face. She already does, bro. Should I even be asking her to prom? What, what if she thinks I'm joking? She's definitely gonna think I'm joking. Like, like, what? Who's gonna, who wants to go with a loser like me to prom? Like, why? We just met each other, like, months ago. Why? How? Why? <laughs> then maybe we can go as friends. Or, ah, no, I'm being stupid. No, that's not gonna work. We're only friends, though, right? I, I can do it, right? I, 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 I can do this. I can do this. I can't do this. I won't do this. I can't. I shouldn't. I should, but I can't. Because I won't. Because I'm scared that she'll reject me. Because I'm a bad person. Ah! <laughs> We've been having fun together. We've been bonding. Oh, man, I sound so lame. But we have been getting closer. She likes my company, right? She likes me dashing through the snow in a one horse open sleigh. Through the fields we go, laughing on the way. <laughs> it's so weird it being Christmas time and not seeing snow on the ground. It's because it's in, uh, <laughs> in the Philippines where summer is in our winters and winter is in their summers. Merry Christmas. Is it Christmas Day? Christmas Eve? Uh, aren't they supposed to sing? Hmm. Damn! That's crazy. That's crazy. Wow, Sana all. Damn, they got a whole freaking like bed sheet for that money. Bro, what? I gotta make this place a little more festive. Yeah, your your house does not look very uh, good. He's gonna put one thing up. I I uh, I bet you that he's gonna put one thing up. Ain't no way you're doing your whole house. It's one thing. It's a Christmas tree at the front. Nice. You did all of that just for that. Ooh, thought this old thing wouldn't work. But there, that's a little better. Barely! At least the house won't look as empty anymore. Now we wait by the gate. For ye late join the triumph of the sky. Proclaim Christ was born in Bethlehem. This is the end of the episode. I'll see you again for until then. Bye. Bye.